Hey, thanks for joining me today. So I wanted to make a quick video for you guys to show you how the uh, my Autel uh, Maxicom Pro uh, is hopefully able to do the rodeo test, uh, the famous rodeo test that the dealerships are charging an arm and a couple legs for. Uh, let me go ahead and plug this bad boy in, start the car, and uh, see uh, how it all goes down. So... Firstly, we have to find our plug. Let's see where that guy is. Nope, that's a hole. Oh, uh, the most obvious thing here has a cover, which is nice. There we go. So that's plugged in. Go ahead and... Uh, Turn this bad boy on. I'm gonna get out of the car for the actual test, but oh yeah, start the car. Hear that exhaust note, I am completely intoxicated by it. Put the phone a little bit closer. It is a beautiful thing. Is it on? Did I miss it or what? Oh, I missed it. Okay. So, up for diagnosis. Diagnostics what have you we are plugged in so let's auto detect the VIN I think this didn't work for me last time if I'm not mistaken there's that intermittent AC problem I told you about it's on auto full blast all three are on auto and nothing is happening nothing I'm gonna have to figure out with the blower motor see if that does anything take it apart hopefully it's uh, down here actually let's see if well hopefully it's down there I'm gonna have to do some research on that but in any case this should have been already done so I assume it's not gonna work through this method uh, so we're gonna have to just go in through Mercedes and tell it what kind of car it is yeah VIN scanning failed no idea no idea why so we go into Mercedes Diagnosis type manual. Uh, SL two thirty O three to O six left hand steering six hundred. Uh, I don't know which one it is. Let me see if I can check my records real quick. So my records show 476, so that's what I'm going to click on. Reading VIN. And from here, I think it was... Well, let's not jump the gun. See if it uh, reads it. No? Yes? No? No idea. Oh, VIN is blank. Oops. Oops, what did I press? Ah, diagnosis, okay. I did not need diagnosis, I needed hot function. Bring the hotness, nope. That is not what I needed. 
Uh, we are not programming anything, so I guess I did need diagnosis. Control unit. We're gonna do the chassis. We are gonna do the suspension. And from here, there should be a whole bunch of, or, or not, uh, active test. Go into active test. Is, here's a bunch of, yes. Check this out. So, there is, uh, I'm just gonna let you guys read this, of what it's able to do. But, if you'll notice here, it says rodeo. I don't know what it's focusing on, but right right there it says rodeo so let's uh, hop out of the car and see what it do okay so um, I'm out of the car the car is running let me go ahead and press that rodeo button uh, when the function has ended the trouble code is erased do you want to perform actuation now sure I don't know if I had a trouble code but let's uh Actually, hang on a sec. Altering sure. Cyclically alternating actuation of all struts in a circular motion. I guess that's what I want. Risk of... Oh, yeah. Skip the step. Risk of injury. Read this. Closed trunk, engine hood, and all doors. What is happening with this autofocus we got going on here? There we go. Uh, close strong, confirm I have read safety notes and all that good stuff. Go ahead and press OK. I'm going to press OK. Let's uh, focus on the car here. Anything? Ah. One more step. So... Active body control pressure sensor is at 20, almost 2700 PSI. Uh, requirement engine at idle, we have that going on. Okay, this should be the final step. Is everyone ready? I'm gonna press F3 to start. Oh, check that out. Mercedes level diagnostics with an Autel Maxicom MK908P for Pro. The Pro just programs the 908, regular 908 does, as far as I know, the same thing, except for programming. Very, very interesting stuff. Yeehaw! That rodeo. So the uh, Autel is telling me actuation can you alternate 413 times so every time it's doing one of these full circles it's going down by one I think now it says 412 I'm not gonna stand here and wait for this to happen 400 more times so I'm gonna go ahead and stop it and it just leveled off beautiful beautiful piece of machinery both the SL and this Autel. It's a beautiful thing. I can't believe it does the rodeo test and all of these other things. And this is just for suspension. There's a dynamic test. Who knows? Who knows what that is? But I like the rodeo. I just wanted to share this with you guys. Thank you for joining me today. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.